guys welcome to or welcome back to Exposed and if I'm welcoming you back and you like it here I'd love it if you stayed and sobbed comment time <laughs> double speed is totally annoying hard to watch I get you Tambi I'm going to do it um, I'm going to slow it down for everybody either speed is fine by me I just look forward to any videos you post thank you wigging out Catcher, that speed is good, Jules. Whatever that was, I hope that's the one I've picked. <laughs> Catcher, no way is that meal for three servings. I know, three mouthfuls more like. Hababble, I'm hysterical. But isn't that what she said? I played it four times for Jed and he's like, Hababble, what is she saying? I'm like, I know, Hababble. So from now on, happy hour, it will now be known as Hababble. User IU, haha, -ha. nope, the food doesn't look appetising at all. Hey y'all from sunny South Africa. Oh wow, it's beautiful out there and very hot. <laughs> Enjoy the sun, I hate it. <laughs> Music lover Liz, off topic, Lisa's looking really weird lately. She looked better when she had the mole under her eye. The sun damage on her body is terrible looking. Her over overly? Her overly made up face doesn't match her neck and chest and those boobs, just terrible. I, I just said to Jed tonight, that just looking at her, but her, I used to say my gran had chicken skin because you know when you roast a chicken and I always used to nick the skin. <laughs> Julie, have you, no, but it looked just like that, like you could just peel it off and that's how her arms look and it's like, surely she doesn't think that's a good look really sweet thing thank you so much for typing that entire message out about my hair i really appreciate it meet virginia the only thing i like in her house is the acrylic chair and the two horse statues same and i might take the jackalope poor little thing <laughs> meet virginia everything is from a high dollar store and it's all tacky looking I buy things from Walmart, Ross, Big Lots, thrift stores, yard sales and sometimes Coles. Yes, and I bet your home is very cosy and inviting and warm. Hers just look like a mishmash of shy. I, I just, none of it, none of it went together. Lordy, her kittens are a bit chunky, meow. I know, she's been told to put them on a diet and she won't. Killing them with kindness. I've just it's really sad. You should do the video I'm so sorry, an apology to my sisters. She said a bunch of lies about them. Go figure. Ooh. Right, hang on. Did I Google that and not? Hi guys, well I'm so sorry and apologies to my sisters. Right, that will be added to the list, meet Virginia. I remember watching this back in the day. She's so gross. I'm sorry about the sound in that. I don't know why. Do you know what I think it might have been? I got a copyright strike on it because of the music that was playing behind her in the restaurant. So there's a thing you can do on YouTube where it's, you can mute the song and it you can either mute the, 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 the entire section or just the song. And because she was talking at the time, I clicked just mute the song, but it seemed to bring everything really down and I don't know why, but that's my excuse. And I'm sticking to it. Vicky, my lovely Jules, come to Greece and I promise you'll have your huge bathroom with the mini pool and a woman taking care of you 24-7. You're sweet. I said to Jed, someone's offered me to go over and, and they've got three bathrooms and I can have one. <laughs> and he's like... Bella, this was perhaps the most boring home tour that I've ever seen. The only upside to this is Jules. Thank you. Her commentary on Lisa is hilarious. Is that a DVD player? Duh. How does the woman even function in everyday life? And it makes you wonder, doesn't it? 
Oh yes, she has John to look after her and lift that heavy, heavy duty lamp of hers while she does. I thought she had cleaning ladies. Look here everybody, here are my five drawers of sunnies, here are my coasters, here's my silverware, here's my vase. Ugh, has Lisa D1 changed much from 2018 until now? No, nope. once a narcissist, always a narcissist, so true. Serin, too much sun can make dry skin oily. Ah, I never knew that. Well, I wouldn't know that because I hate the sun. I was a vampire in a previous life. And see, I'm sat in a room with the blinds down. I don't know if it's day or night. Because somebody said to me, you should be wearing SPF. And I said, I don't leave the house. And they're like, even the sun coming in the window. I said, I'm nowhere near a window. And the blinds are down. I don't need SPF. Uh, Lisa knows how to slap on expensive foundations, but she pays no mind to basic skin knowledge. Exactly. I'm feeling kind of feisty today, so I'm going to say it. Lisa looks incredibly cheap for all the money she spends on herself. Like a low-rent Pam Anderson. <laughs> oh, that's going to sting. Deb, yes, we all think it. You're so right. A cheap knockoff is what she is. Susan, that tan, tan body and pale face. What the fuck? I know. It's insane. MJ Brownlee. Oh, oily face but dried up leather body. Jules, girls, you... Right, hang on, 129, let's see what happened. Hey, guys, it's Lisa. You kill me. You're so awesome, so on point. <laughs> I sometimes make myself laugh, too, if I go back and watch it. Thank you. John has gone to the gym for a workout. Sure. For real. Either he's seen someone or just wants to get away from her, lol. That's what we reckon, Lauren. Christine. This eyeliner technique of hers reminds me of Endora, Samantha's mother on Bewitched. She was begging for eyeliner too. What words of wisdom? I never knew that different shaped eyes required different techniques. How effing condescending. It's her all over, isn't it? Condescending and fucking snarky. MJ Brownlee, John, oh, same thing. Caroline, every time she says and, it's like nails on the chalkboard. I know, and. 6.31, she looks just like Brooke. Let's have a look. Don't even wash them. <laughs> <sighs> Big droopy cheeks and tiny sad eyes. They do not have the cutest family genes. Maybe Lisa's mama looks similar. That's why she doesn't want to put her on. She's scared everyone will pull her apart. And the thing is, no one would pull her apart. Because we don't know her. We've got nothing to say about her. And Lisa's made it sound to her, oh, mama, you wouldn't want to do Oh, it's terrible. You know what I mean? And it's like, her mum would probably have a, a whale of a time on a YouTube video, but she won't, she won't share the fucking limelight, will she? Peg, of all the times she's done wing eyed line, wing eyed, <laughs> winged eyeliner, and they always look wonky, don't they, though? Here we go again, MJ. You're picking out all the weirdest things. What a good name that they have. Is Satin and it's 100R. They have good names. So that one definitely has. <laughs> but that was the thing. She, she was she being sarcastic. <laughs> it was hard to tell. What a good name that they have. I wonder if she's just used to lying straight up and doesn't bat an eye. And shit just flies out of her mouth. Or is she circling the drain and is not all other men mentally? I don't know. Because she, lo she looked dead serious, didn't she? Oh, what good names they've got. 100R. Okay. Run for your lives. The face filter on the one putting in the workout. The her face filter is the one putting in the workout. The contrast between the rest of her skin and her face. Oh, it's weird, isn't it? Cat Mama. Maybe if her subscribers would tell her the truth, 
that she looks like a prune, that her hair looks like straw. Maybe she'd listen and do something. No, she wouldn't. She'd just sit in a corner and cry. Stay out of the sun. Stop bleaching the heck out of that hair. But they keep telling her she's so gorgeous and doesn't age, so you can lead a horse to wall a horse. But the thing is, though, they people have told her for years, use sunscreen, stay out of the sun, do this, do that. And she's like, she doesn't care. She doesn't listen. They can tell her till they're blue in the face. Even if she got skin cancer, that wouldn't make her stop, I don't think. 2632, I just realised what her fingernails remind me of. When little dogs have overgrown nails. Look and do this and I do like... I know they're odd, aren't they? The way they stick up and out. Weird. Yuck. So weird that she would think they look good like that. The, her nail tech must flip them up and out purely out of hate. Because why would he not do them straight out? Exactly. Brooke, my daughter that's 24. We know! MM. I'm not changing my name anymore, Jules. I'm confusing myself too. Thank you, MM. Lisa also drinks from styrofoam cups at home. I know. God, I hate the feel of that. Why she wants to... Why she wants to, who knows? Probably reminds her of her childhood shit. That's the thing. It's weird. And then... Oh, we could go on for hours about her weirdness, couldn't we? Deb. The Emperor's new makeup. Oh my God, Jules, best line ever. I didn't see anything either. We never do, Deb. It's the same fucking thing, day in, day out. Bonnie, same look, different day. Exactly. Panda, on the hamster wheel, exhausting. Bonnie, lol, so true. Isn't it, though? It's like, at least, just for once, do something different. Patricia Burns, 90s model makeup, Lisa. I just can't with her. Hope you're well, Jules. Not too bad at all, thank you, Patricia. Hope you're well, too. Jane, whatever dumb fuck did to her face, her eyes are tiny, beady, without makeup. She really is not an attractive woman. I see more beautiful women on every day. The beautiful thing is these women have no idea that they're so beautiful. Dumb fuck thinks she's gorgeous. She isn't. Exactly. Does an air about somebody that doesn't care and they're unapologetically themselves and they're a thousand times more beautiful than she is with a full face of slap i use about half a pump my skin doesn't need covering to bejesus i know what was two pumps on either side what the hell susan i hate the way she says tone and i tone home all of those things are ooh. I can't imagine what she looks like in person. All that makeup. I think much, too much makeup ages someone. Less is more as we age. Carol, I think we can agree that Lisa is not a natural beauty. Makeup to the rescue. <laughs> James, hello, how are you? I could literally make an entire YouTube response video to this alone. If she is this so-called fashion and beauty influencer and someone who gives such inspiration to us less fortunate women and gays out there lol why is she so all over the place and insecure with this home tour you can tell what and who she is by this alone from the very beginning when she showed her entryway table and the lamps in, co in comparison to the mirror and how they're overlapping one another i was done she has no concept of who she is because the style and dimensions are outrageous. On a scale of 1 to 10, I would give that a 2. <laughs> She's showing us a window ledge of random bottles all over the place on her bathroom window. You could tell she feels weird, but then again, she doesn't know how to edit vid videos. So it'll just have to stay there. An artist who she bought something from. They didn't ask to be in her home. She never knows the name of anyone. It's such a slap in the face. No reason this woman should be making videos. I totally agree with it all. <laughs> and um, that horse is like my gold one upstairs. I went back and luckily they still had more because I love that horse. And I got in from the same pottery place. Um, the mirror... I. See, I didn't know if it was his ears or a horn. 
Unicorn. That's not a horse. Unicorn. <laughs> Spell it for you. U-N-I-C-O. You've left the R out. N. Unicorn. <laughs> Four twenty-eight. What happened at four twenty-eight? I think this has a lot of aviators. They've gotten messy. Where I've been all just thrown in on top of each other. None of them in their case. I'm sorry. Wasn't this a home tour? I didn't know that we were going inside the drawers of your home, which no one cares about. Maybe you should have saved that for a sunglass sunglass haul video where you can show all of the things that you have that a lot of other people can't have because they have responsibilities. That's all for now. Thanks. See you back. 6.53. Then just to kind of take up that space and be over that plug and every that outlet there. And then um, the little star. That's a beautiful corner for a lovely large house, lovely large house plants and a wall sconce like fixture. But we know that won't happen. Just so you know, a lot of stores have been using different types of animals and adding antlers to them to make them acceptable for the holidays or as jewellery holders. It's eclectic and bizarre, but cool if you have the style in your home. Yeah, I've seen that would think, but I'd never heard of a ja jackalope. I, I live in a bubble, I'm telling you. It's like, I didn't see grass when I lived in London. Do you know what I mean? When I was in Wales, everything was about farming. And now I'm living in the 1800s. So fuck all happens here. So I've missed out on jackalopes altogether. But yeah, I see the things for hanging jewellery on. And that's the thing. See, she buys these things and puts all her jewellery on them. And it's like, no, that's for when you take it off to get in the shower or to go to bed or whatever. That's what that type of thing's for. Not to have your entire jewellery collection hanging off a horse. 9.31 to 9.38. Um, so I got those here. I want to know, are there records in there? Is there a record player anywhere in this house? I bet there isn't. Huge candlesticks from a kind of like a resale in and that cabinet is John, Will and Brooks evacuation kits for them. Lisa head starts spinning around like a poltergeist demanding more Gucci sunglasses. They escape just in time before the house explodes. Designer purses and black blazers are everywhere. Panda. D1 loves anything from the, Nord, from the Nordstrom. Like the... Oh, I'm sorry, this wire is getting to my tits. Like the Galan, Gal uh, why can't I say that word? Galan at $93 a pop. Notice she didn't speak about her beloved Hourglass Foundation for $58. Valentino lipstick at $45. Sicily lip liner. Se what? $70 for a friggin' lip liner. Why doesn't she go for Tom Ford products? Clearly, the products are chosen for the price point, aren't they, though? I don't care what's what the speed is what speed this cow is on do it i'm doing it next james hey ray just thought you might like to know that pizza box in her home tour mj she uh walked into a teeny tiny kitchen and beside the fridge was a white thing on the counter and it's for making pizzas uh mama and daddy bought it for wheel and so it's out on the side but it's like how much for a pizza making thingy but i'm glad they bought it for him because that poor boy gets frig all I can watch most everything in double speed when I'm alone, but if the kids and husband insist on talking to me, I can't. I'm kidding, kind of. <laughs> Janet, you need to change your channel name to Exposed by a Fool. Do you ever get that fat body out of bed? Who's the lucky guy? Oh, you're fucking hysterical, Janet. You should be on Channel 4. I can see why you're so obsessed with this woman. She's beautiful, in shape and gorgeous. You're the reversal. 
Do you have hair, madam? Ooh. Bonnie, so does anyone want to start commenting? How many of you live outside the US? Go on, go get there and start chatting, people. My favourite videos. Cool. So, I was reading an article about Swedish death cleaning. I've watched a few videos about that. It's really good, isn't it? Can you imagine all the stuff Lisa's family would need to go through? It's quite scary, really. I hope no one thinks I wish her harm because I don't. No, we don't, Bonnie. We all know you well enough. But all that useless junk. When my mum passed away, I donated £200 of clothes and that was in one bedroom in a one bedroom condo everyone's comments were spot on jules you definitely bring laughter to all of us and for this i thank you thank you bonnie claire do we know what happened with kim kim met her once they went to uh they did a live outside somewhere where you eat Lardy was an ob obnoxious twat the entire time. She showed uh, Kim her kit in her car for shop shoplifting, allegedly, don't come for me. Um, was trying to bully her way into Kim's house and said, oh, I should come to your house when you're doing uh, bag videos and I can model for them. And Kim's husband was like, yeah, nope, that's not happening. Um, and then she turned on her like she does with everybody and was a complete bitch. Use a GF. I have never put on my fucking makeup. Had a theme. I know. What theme do I want it to have today? How about circus clown? Julie, I really don't know why she does these so-called tutorials. She does the same look over and over. Boring. Just once, I would like to see her do a look without the tingly wing eyeliners of hers and put some colour on her eyes that we can all see and do a lip with colour. It's just makeup. She could always wash it off after doing it. Exactly. With the amount of makeup she owns, it's not like she'd be wasting anything. She has plenty of backup makeup. This woman drives me crazy. Loosel man. I don't wear lipstick to the pool the beach or the lake i just wear lip balm yeah most of us do well i don't go but you know what i mean normal people do does anyone else notice the bottom teeth lip situation it appears as though her bite's not aligned properly or is it filters that are causing the weird bottom lip situation or maybe i'm imagining it all no you're not it's starting her, her bottom jaw is starting to protrude and i don't ever remember her it doing that before so she'll be looking into getting something done with that soon but of course she didn't bother to do it for will did she robin that overly made up face looks as if it doesn't belong to the completely sun damaged fried body of hers does she really want skin cancer that bad brooke getting caught up on your videos she's doing the same old boring nonsense as usual she said in previous videos that she was raised in a different environment yeah, Lisa, my parents didn't pay me to clean their house while I was married. Why do people think this dingbat has money? Come out here to Cali, let's see. Uh, it's awful out there, isn't it, prices? Christine, is there a woman alive who wants to wear a full coverage foundation in the heat of summer? All you need at most is a tinted sunscreen. I wonder if this was the shopping trip that they were all going to take. I think it is. Everybody was going and then it was just the two of them. This whispering thing kooks me out. I know I hate her whisper. It's weird. Those foundations were identical. I'm getting so sick of this same look over and over again. As are we all. And yes, I have mature oily skin. Juicy cheeks, I suppose. From now on, I'll tell the world that I'm not oily, just juicy. Yeah, that sounds so much better. This bare face is definitely not the face of a pretty woman. Actually, I think she's rather unattractive. I'd bet good money that she'll never wear this lipstick again. Anything with a bit of colour in, she runs a mile. Oh my God, hold me down. Hold me down so I don't go near the Trish McAvoy counter. Oh, I, have to, I have to be strong until I get to Nordstrom's. Anyone on the naughty step? Oh! Janet, you're on the naughty step. 
The reason you can't see anything, madam, is because of those Coke bottle glasses. You're so jealous, madam, it really shows with your language. How does my language make me jealous? Barbara Moore, Jules, you're the best. Thank you for another great video. Every day is full of stress and dealing with ageing and pain. You always provide much needed laughter. It's hard to believe D1 lives each day to shop and do makeup videos. I, like you, would never want her life, so, so no jealousy here. Can you imagine having to buy extras in case they don't make it again? Have a great day. It's quite sad really, isn't it, Barbara? And you can just go in the bin. Jules, who's Bob? Hang on, let me go back. This video shows the true foundation of her persona. She's horrible, Margot. You can see it quite clearly there. Even if she is smiling and using the sweet southern charm. I wonder when her and John were having a hard time. goes into how it's because she was using too much masculine energy mm. and he was reacting to that maybe when Lisa's masculine energy demanded they move and she get the whole upstairs her empire room and was wearing all those suits and if I recall correctly she took ridiculous pictures on her desk like she was the CEO or something she's I know and it's like and now she isn't even fucking using the upstairs Mitts hack it she has gas to drive all over the place to eat exactly she has plenty of money because will keeps her cupboards full this is just a stop to the casino her non-tent video i like that non-tent her non-tent videos are so difficult to watch she is one old grifter i would love to see her taken off of youtube thanks jules well one went so we can but hope there's another one nancy barrett jules who's bob Bob is a photographer that lives on the moon that used to take pictures of Lardy because she, her arm couldn't get far enough to make her her big face look little. So she employed Bob and that's Bob. And some I need Bob on the moon to take a picture of me lately because of this. But it's like everyone keeps going on about how fat I am. I'm not. It's the, I've just got a fat face. I've lost all the weight on my body, so whatever. But yeah, Bob's the photographer on the moon. And that is the end. Hoorah! If you made it here with me, congratulations. And I will see you in the next one.